All right, got a bit of a new story for you today. Ubuntu is dropping the Unity desktop and phone and focusing on cloud and IoT. Let's check that out right now on the Linux Lounge. Alright then, so as you can see here, um, we've got the official Ubuntu announcement uh, that they are going to drop the uh, Unity desktop and phone. Uh, the most important bit is of course the opening bit here, I will probably just read that now. Uh, we are wrapping up an excellent quarter and an excellent year for the company, with performance in many teams and products we can be proud of. As we head into the new physical year, it is appropriate to reassess each of our initiatives. I'm writing to let you know that we will end our investment in Unity 8, the phone, and convergence. Anyone wondering that what that was? I believe it is to do with the Ubuntu phone and the Ubuntu desktop. Don't quote me on that though because I'm not entirely sure. Uh, we will shift our default Ubuntu desktop back to GNOME for Ubuntu 17.04. Now the first thing to note, the uh, oh eighteen point oh four rather, the first thing to know about this is obviously the next release of Ubuntu seventeen point oh four will have the Unity desktop. And uh, the first thing I've got to say about this is yeah, pretty sad to see this go. Um, I actually rather like the Ubuntu, uh, Unity desktop. I mean, it did have one or two stability issues and the sort, but um. I liked the idea of snaps and that, and I thought it was quite a good looking desktop. Um, no, not snaps, I mean uh, scopes. Same difference, effectively. Uh, well, no, it's a completely different thing, but that's besides the point. Um, it had many modern features that other desktops just didn't have, like uh, searching the web and that sort of thing, um, which I never used, but was a good feature to have, and it had all sorts of like little things that were quite good, um, like when you change wallpaper, the color of the uh, little dark thing changes, which is quite good. Um, they're also dropping the Ubuntu phone, which is a shame because I thought that had potential, and um, was probably one of the best ways to get over Linux on the phone. Sailfish is probably a little bit better, but that's besides the point. Um, and they're going to be switching to no of all things. Now, which seems like a bit of an unfortunate decision to me, because Unity is what made Ubuntu Ubuntu, as opposed to some free spin GNOME distribution. Um, now, it's quite possible that they'll be customising GNOME quite heavily with extensions and that sort of thing. Uh, so with any luck, it'll be you know sort of Ubuntu. -y. Um, yeah, quite sad to see it go. Uh, apparently, it's to do with um, you know people not really liking it and sort. But apparently, this is a big enough story that the BBC actually ended up covering. So that's interesting. But um, yeah, there's not really a lot to say about it other than that. Uh, Canonical are dropping the Unity desktop in favour of GNOME. Uh, now, presumably, you will be able to run Unity in one form or fashion in the new Ubuntu, should you want to, but then there might be any bug fix and that sort of thing. And then there's just some other stuff in this article. I will leave it down in the description, should you want to read it in full. But that's the most important bit. Thanks for watching.